Today, as Rewilding Europe, we are very delighted and also very proud that we're signing, we have signed this contract with the European Investment Bank, the first loan agreement under the NCFF and the Bank on Nature Initiative. For those who don't know us, Rewilding Europe is a relatively young initiative, European initiative, with the aim to make Europe a wilder place for the benefit, benefit of both nature and people, of course. We offer a new additional vision for nature conservation in Europe, where there's more space for wild nature, for wildlife, and for natural processes, and where pe local people can make, as what we say, a fair living from the wild. We believe that in a continent where we have lost so much nature and biodiversity, we should not only protect what we have, but we should also restore nature at large scale, providing new opportunities for a modern 21st century Europe. This can create a base for new ways of developing rural economies on the European countryside, where young people are leaving to cities where land abandonment is happening in many areas at a large scale. This is def definitely a threat to those local economies. Um, but maybe we can also turn this threat into an opportunity, and well, we believe so. Just recently, we saw another publication on the finance gap on conservation by the Institute for European Environmental Policy. We believe that involving the private sector in financing biodiversity through the NCFF is an important step towards closing this gap, involving other sectors in society to take a role. Also, rewilding approaches where nature takes more of its own course can help to make conservation more cost-effective in, uh, in achieving EU biodiversity targets. Rewilding Europe now works in eight areas across Europe where we are pioneering to help a transition from marginal, low-productive, subsidized agricultural systems to more servicing economy where local communities earn income and have jobs based on wild nature and the wildlife around them. In turn, this creates incentives to protect and restore. These showcases could serve as inspirational examples for what also can be achieved elsewhere. It's not about investing in the landscapes of the past, but the landscapes of the future, where wild nature has a place and where conservation is not inherently connected with cultural landscapes, where people are managing nature with high costs. With more people living in urban areas in Europe, with many iconic wildlife species coming back, and that's a conservation success thanks to the the, the Birds and Habitats Directive in particular. And with the fast-growing demand for nature-based tourism like wildlife watching, we believe there is an unlocked market opportunity for such nature-based economies. But we also want to pioneer how other sectors like water management, forestry, hunting and energy can contribute to building nature-based economies. And this is the natural capital we are referring to here today. And like many other conservation initiatives, Pioneering and supporting nature-based economies in these areas is core to our work and one of our main objectives. We strongly believe that such nature-based economies involving the private sector can largely benefit both nature and people. Our enterprise team supports such businesses in different ways, ranging from technical support, financial support through Rewilding Europe Capital, uh, but also promotional support. Rewilding Europe Capital is in fact Europe's first uh, conservation and rewilding investment financing facility, which we started a few years ago. Our pioneering work in those few years, with now 17 loan agreements already happening in five different countries, show a very promising initial results and uh, gave us a huge learning curve. The signing of this contract today with the ERB is a great step forward for rewilding Europe capital. It allows us to really scale up our efforts and beneficial outcomes. But more than this, it also throws a spotlight on the ability of commercial finance to contribute positively to nature conservation and re rewilding. The long-term goal, as you've heard, of Rewilding Europe Capital is to support 30 nature-focused businesses across Europe and create 250 jobs through the businesses which it supports. We're very much looking forward to work with the EIB and the Commission and their NCFF to continue to stimulate and underpin wildlife and nature-based businesses in rural areas thereby making an essential contribution to the comeback of wild nature and wildlife in European landscapes. The EIB and the European Commission should be applauded for their ongoing commitment and enthusiasm for the NCFF. Thank you very much.